back. Okay. I think there's only a couple of giants in the entire quest, right? Because there's the one at the start, but the tribe kills that one. That's not a problem. Then I think there's one or two inside the cave. And then there's the one you have to fight at the end. But the one, the, the ones inside the cave, you have your Mars helping you. Um... Huh. Interesting. Okay, so I do need to have access to the Orc Strongholds. Um... Oh, fuck. Okay. Um. <sighs> you need a Daedra heart. So, I can't use the Daedra heart potion. Because you need a data heart. That's... That's kind of scary. I was hoping to make a potion with a data heart that would... Basically, it does... Pre it's pretty similar to Power of Life. Um, in that it basically makes you invincible for a short period of time. My headphones are super tangled here. Um, but, unfortunately, I can't do that. It's a good thing I checked. I did not remember that you needed a data heart to start this quest. Oh, fuck. I just tangled it the wrong way. I like super tangled it. There we go. So, yeah, okay. I've got a data heart, which is fine. Um, and troll fat you also need, apparently, but that, that's easy enough to get my hands on. Uh, okay. Well, that does make things a little trickier. Apparently, Waking Nightmare, the alchemy room for Waking Nightmare contains the Daedra Heart as well as Troll Fat. That's an interesting proposition. Although, Waking Nightmare, I imagine, being quite hard. Yeah, um, uh, hmm. Okay. Uh, oh, can you steal from companions? Steal what? A Daedra Heart? There isn't a Daedra Heart in the companions. That's been removed in Requiem. Otherwise, yeah, that would be by far the easiest one to get. There's no, There are no Daedra Hearts that are easy to access in Requiem. The easiest one to get is the one that I've just got. The one from beating Velixane. Um... Other places where Daedra Hearts are, there's one in the in the Alchemy Room in Nightcrawler Temple, I think that's still there, that was there in Vanilla, I think it's still there in Requiem. Uh, there's one in Blackreach. Um, uh, obviously, Pieces of the Past, if you kill the Dramora there, though that's far from an easy proposition. There's the random Daedra in Labyrinthian, uh, though... He's accompanied by two quite powerful Atronarchs, which can be a problem. And he's quite a powerful spellcaster himself. <clears throat> mm. Tricky. I'm still disappointed that I haven't found a single good amulet, if I'm honest. Okay. I can have a think about it, but... Uh, let's go do um let's go finish the do the companions quest first. 
Yeah, quick way to go to healing. Need a ride? Where do you want to go? Climb and back and we'll be off. Beating up this random dude in Dawnstar. Still can't believe that I have no good circlets and um no good amulets. And I'm like Quite a long way into this run. And the ring that I've got is just the one that I bought from Farkas, which is like a guaranteed spawn. You know, I mean, look at this. This is trash. Maybe I need to fight... S what do I need to do? Just fight some more bandits, maybe? I'm not sure. The, uh... Oh, he's got an arrow on him. Sorry. Sorry, bud. Oh, that's what's weighing me down. Daedric's sword. Have I got random soul fat? I don't think I do, because I've probably made it all into frenzy poisons. Yeah, I don't. Okay. There is an alchemy store here, so we'll see if we can do that one. If we can get any from there. Oh, it's that guy. Okay, hang on. Let's sell this guy the fucking sword first. Take a look. It's 754. Can you afford it? Oh, obviously okay. yes, he can if I'm naked. Steel. Needed that. Looking to protect yourself or deal some right, damage. Cool. That's fine. Also have this arrow. Um. Okay. I guess I didn't need to sell it to this guy because I can sell things to anyone, but. Hey, buddy. You can't scare me into I should use my armor first. Fuck. Come on. Let's see what you're made of. It's fine. I did remember to use transmute, so I had the damage boost. You're tougher than you look. All right, cool. Uh, we can start pieces of the past as well. There's no particular reason to start it now, though. I don't think. Uh, maybe there is. Yeah, just gives us more options. Hello. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, yeah. Don't care. Your loss, and here you are. Let's talk. Your loss. This dialogue is so glitchy because he keeps trying to like insist on talking to you, but also kind of not talking to you. Yeah, yeah. Blah, blah. A little. One of these. That was almost a hundred and fifty. At least here are my notes about him. I'll gladly pay you for getting the people. Um, so, oh, actually, this is where the Silver Hand Fort is, right? Let's go do that. Did they ever send you to beat up a Yarl? That'd be cool. No, there's a fixed list of people, and none of them are, none of them are Yarls. I've never been sent to beat up, like, Maven Blackbriar either. I think it's up there, right? It's right here. So let's um let's buff up. My drama. Beef stew, porker stew. We'll leave off the fondue for now. Hopefully won't be necessary. Blur is mostly for arrows. At this point, it's possible that we don't need blur. And the blur is actually kind of a liability. But, uh, we'll see. Mm. This is it. I think it's... What is it called? Fort, it's not Fort Bellhammer, is it? Driftshade Refuge? Is that what it is? No, no, that's Dawncaller Temple. West Rift Shade Refuge. Somewhere around here. I'm starting to suspect that maybe I don't actually know where the Dawn Guard hideout is. The Dawn Guard, the, um, the Silver Hand hideout is. Let's uh, redo transmute.
Oh my god, are you attacking me? Holy fuck! What? What? Why are you attacking me? And why are you not a red dot? What is happening here? Oh, it is a red dot. Wow. Huh, okay. But it could grab the antlers. Is this Drift Shade? Yeah, this is it. This is it, right? Yep, cool. May end up using some magic potions here, but that's fine. We've got fucking tons of them. Oh, apparently I'm in combat. Have they noticed me already? Yeah, he has. Yes, okay, they are silver hands, officially. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. That was a lot of damage through blur. Holy crap. Okay, well, good thing I have blur active, isn't it? Jesus. Yeah, let's just go for this, I mean. That, unfortunately, is very much not a warhammer. Uh, neither is whatever this person has, presumably. Can I go in here? I can. It's not locked or anything. What the hell is that? It's a poison. I didn't even know the silver hand used poisons. What? What is the poison? Deadly poison. One point of damage... Point per second to health and stamina. Uh, I don't understand why my stamina is ticking down. Because this is one point per second. Which my Hawker Stew should be counteracting. So why is it ticking down? What is what is going on with that? That is confusing, okay. Doesn't seem right, but but fine. Um. Wow, that's long lasting. Uh oh, why we are owing just because of the high damage? Yeah, it was surprising, but not something that I can't deal with. Got a lot of healing, a lot of healing. Um. Maybe we should pick up more of these potions, just so I can pound them. Wait for that to finish. It's fucking hell. Do they always use poisons like this? Also, can I just point out... Don't I have, like, mad poison resist? Oh, wow. What? 30%? That perk is terrible. I thought it was way more than 30%. I mean, it's mandatory to get the others, but... It's only 30%? Really? Oh, okay, so it's 50% for disease and 25% for poison, so... I guess I already had 5% poison resist from somewhere. Ah, Fortified Muscles does buff stamina regen, that's good to know. The, the thing which boosted my health and my stamina. Um. Oh my... God, alchemical intellect is so fucking strong. It's 100 magicka. Spell duration increased by 5%. Spell magnitude increased by 5%. Spell cost decreased by 5%. And restores one magicka per second. That's so fucking good. And this perk is apparently extremely strong as well. 50% boost to the magnitude of most potions. Well, no, 50% magnitude to the to potions which restore health, stamina, or magicka, and any potions which deal damage. And then all other potions are boosted by 20%. That's crazy good. Um, but yeah, we do need to join the Dark Brotherhood to get that shit. So, make of that what you will. Um... 
How much health am I missing right now? 296, uh, So like 160? Is that more than 160? Yeah, it's probably more than 160. That should be fine. That'll restore me to full. And now stamina. I mean, I guess we can just wait for it to come back. Alternatively, we can use the stamina potion and then be done with it. Because we've got fucking hundreds of them. Where is Frost? Put some in the holes. Frosty poos. Thank y'all. Um, don't need too many of these potions. I'll just get myself up to ten of each. Which I think is what I have now. Oh, that's actually better. Damn. Okay. Um, and yeah. I guess let's get on with it. Beef stew. Orcus stew. Yeah, okay, cool. We're good, we're good, we're good. And what's the duration on transmute? Three minutes. Renewing that wouldn't be the worst thing. How much is it boosting by? 113 points. That's a fucking lot, isn't it? Jesus. That says 242. It very clearly is more than 242. It is, in fact, by my reckoning, around 600. Okay. Let's give this a go, then. Problem is, if we come up against a Warhammer guy, we'll be in trouble. Oh, and I don't have Ancestor Guardian. I don't have a safety net right now. And that is potentially a big problem. Fuck, okay. We're going coward mode for this. Oh. Up the stairs, back off. Nice. Okay. Still no Warhammer. That's mostly what I'm here for, so, you know. As soon as I find a Warhammer, we'll be gold. Maybe, hmm. I'm like 90% certain that there were guys with silver Warhammers last time, right? I'm not just making that up. Uh, maybe. Maybe. That's not a Warhammer. Come on, power attack. Yes, good man. Oh, fuck. You're not supposed to get your shield up. Nice. Oh my god, this guy's tanky. Let's just, yeah. Get that going. We've got enough, pa We've got enough stamina to do this. There we go. Just mono power attacks. Currently, these are all silver swords. I'm starting to get a little suspicious. That perhaps... I may be misremembering things. Ooh, red glitter dust. I get to figure out what that does. Oh, it hurts me. Apparently hurts me is what it does. That's... Yay. I'm glad I figured that out. Ooh, dwarven blacksmithing. I didn't know that was here. Lusty Argonian maid. Classic. There more enemies this way? Yes. Okay, back up. They're just investigating. Hello, I'm here. Confirming my location for you. Whoop. Two of them. So back up. See if we can soften them up with the crossbow. Oh my god. Yes, got him. Cool. Uh, all our buffs are still up, yeah? Mage armor, transmute. Yeah, we're good. Hello. Oh, that was terrible. Yeah, if I can get him without that shield up, with a power attack, he's just fucked. And I can just kind of spam this. Because of the stamina potions that I've got. Uh, we'll just kill him, right? Nice. He does a solid whack of damage to my health, but... 
Yeah, maybe I'm just... Maybe I'm a complete fucking idiot. Because every single one of these guys so far has had a silver sword. A regular silver sword, which I thought... I thought more of them had different weapons. At the very least, give me a silver greatsword. I'm pretty sure in vanilla they have silver greatswords, right? I'm not misremembering that. Okay, transmute's done to wear off. Let's redo that. Oh! I should try out Paralyze. See how that goes. Uh, let's just bash this one. Oh, I accidentally put my clothes on. Fuck. That's not right. Nice, okay. Oh, hey, there's someone here. Hello? Hello? Can you find me, please? Because if you can, that would be good. Nice, there we go. Sounds like they found me. Yeah. Sounded like another fucking sword, though. Come on. What? Can you not get... Is this door locked? Motherfucker. I really have to break the door down for you. Yeah, sword. Uh, this does not bode well, guys. This does not bode well. I guess if the plan ultimately is for Lendring, it doesn't matter, but... I really did think that there was, uh... Silver Warhammers amid these guys. Just eating raw garlic because they're so fucking paranoid about the werewolves. Oh, this isn't the end room, is it? This isn't the final room? No. Time to end this oh, hey! That's an elven halberd. That's not a warhammer, but it's the great sword. Yes, good man. Okay, let's get the halberd, halberd lady. Fortunately, because we're naked, we're also faster and more maneuverable. Can, yeah, halberd lady, can you come out front? Because then I can punk you. Nice. Okay, warhammer. Let's back up. Is blur active? Yeah, blur's still up. Okay, come at me, good sir. Charging power attack, please. Good man! I'll show you what a real orc can do. Got him. Thank you. Thank you for showing me what a real orc can do. That was extremely informative. Okay. Out of 57. I think that will end up doing more damage to Draugr than my current weapon. That's better than nothing. It's a hell of a lot better than nothing. Um... Maybe I should try busting out the Paralysis. Because Paralysis seems like a crazy, crazy, crazy powerful spell to just be able to do. Let's get rid of Blur for now. I haven't run into a single arch so far. At least not one which I, I didn't feel like I could deal with. Let's see if we can try out a Paralysis spell on someone. Um, just to see how it works. What? Okay, I had to wait for the uh, the knock to take effect. Is this another area? Oh, it is. Okay. Um, I don't think I'm going to get much more out of this, if I'm honest. None of these guys so far have had warhammers. It's all been swords. It's all been vanilla weapons. So. Maybe I am misremembering. Or maybe whatever mod it is only kicks in once you get to like. Once you do it on the companions side. Or maybe I'm just getting unlucky. I mean to be fair it took me fucking ages before I even saw a dude with a great sword. Um, no, let's just leave. Let's just leave. I've got a silver greatsword, which is probably better than nothing. 
And if I can if I can start using paralysis to its full effectiveness, I think we're in very very good shape. Let's redo my drama and then head out. All right. Um, so from here, we're looking to head over to Solitude just to get back out. Oh no, no, no! Actually, actually, let's head back to Dawnstar. Um, because. Dawnstar, uh, we didn't check the merchant. We should have checked the merchant. Uh, the potion merchant. In Dawnstar. Because as you can see, we know it need... When it comes to alchemy, we need all the fucking help we can get. If we want to ever hit 100. Especially if we want to do it without joining the Dark Brotherhood. Yeah, I think the next thing I should focus on when it comes to training is probably 200. I want to get my 200 up to 50. Uh... <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> it just fell out of the sky. Did something throw it? What? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what? Okay, I, I'm, I'm not even gonna question it. <laughs> oh my god! Thank you, Todd. Thank you for that incredible gift. The gift of laughter. But also, why the fuck am I stuck in combat again? What is that? Oh, whatever. Oh, uh, okay, where's the potion shop? Because I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure there's a potion shop here, isn't there? Oh, maybe there isn't. Morthal has one. But yeah, it looks like there isn't actually a potion shop here. Huh. I thought there was. Okay, cool. We can head to... Let's swing... We can swing by Morthal. Complete silence. For a full, like, 30 fucking seconds. Oh, and, and it's back. Silence is back. A creepy, disturbing silence. What is that red dot? Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna start hooping up the mountain flower that's around here. Um, because, again, we do want to eventually hit 100 alchemy, and... Oh, it's, it's the orc. It's the old orc. I assume that's what's happened here. Um, despite the fact that it is not obvious at all, because the old orc himself does not appear to be here. Unless someone else has killed him somehow. Oh, there he is. Very good at hiding, apparently. An extremely stealthy orc. Let's go! Yes, 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 yes. You can keep insisting. I'm going to fight the motherfucker if you want. I'm definitely not fighting that man. My god, he's scary. Okay, so, for the sake of paralysis, there's a few things I need to do. Firstly, I need to get accepted. Uh, 
into the orc strongholds. And I think the most straightforward way for me to do that now is probably Kolskega Mine. There's a wizard right now. I think I think it's probably Kolskega Mine. Um, also gets me a solid whack of money as well. And... Oh, troll fat! I do need troll fat. Oh, I was hoping to get a knock down there. Fuck. Okay. Get off! Quickly, 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 quickly! Wait, did you find the Warhammer? Silver Warhammer? I did not. No. There we go. Need to get me some troll fat. I uh, I found a um, a silver greatsword, but it looked to me like every single one of those guys, like it didn't seem like any of them had warhammers. Um, unfortunately, so I may have been wrong. I I could have sworn that I ran into a bunch of dudes with warhammers when I did these quests last time, but no one. They all had swords uh, and great swords this time, which is what they have in vanilla. So I'm thinking may maybe I was, like, misremembering or something, or possibly, like, they only start spawning with hammers at a different point, or maybe I just got unlucky and none of them had hammers. But it's very difficult to tell. Um, pretty sure I've already trained this level. I think this was... Oh, no, but I haven't trained... I haven't done all my training. I think I only did a couple of levels. Is that a big deal? What, you mean the, the Silver Warhammer? Um, I don't know. The thing is, if I, I, I mentioned this, the reason why I didn't press further is because if I'm planning on going for Valendrung anyway, it really doesn't matter, because Valendrung will hose Draugr. Valendrung will be very strong against Draugr, and that's what I'm going to be using against Draugr, so I don't really need the Silver Warhammer if I can jump straight up to what is essentially my endgame weapon. Um, but the question remains of whether I actually can do that. I think with the paralysis spell, if it's consistent, I can. Because the paralysis... I mean, the ability to stun lock enemies is ridiculously broken. Um, yes. Where do I want to go? Uh, return to Farkas. Yeah, let's head back to Farkas for now. Oh, I remember. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, no. We'll Kolskega mine, that's what I'm doing. Because I need to gain access to the Orc strongholds for this quest. Um, and Kolskega's the easiest way. Okay, uh, I think I am going to rest so that I get Ancestor Guardian back, because that is kind of a big deal. Also, I have, I picked up a random Orcish bow, apparently, which I'm not sure why I did that. Um, but I can sell the rest of this, so that's gold. I want to practice paralysis in some low state situations so I can get a handle on how consistently it functions. Because if it just randomly fails sometimes, then that's a real, real fucking problem. Like, if this spell is not reliable, that's, uh, that's a concern. I mean, it wouldn't be reliable on someone like Tyranus, for example, because Tyranus has very high magic absorption and um, magic resistance in general. But uh, against, like, basic enemies, like giants... Put on a cloth sack. Nope. Sure thing. It's yours. I'll show you. It's all flying free, baby. Uh, yeah. Let me. Do I have a guardian back? I do. Great. Okay, I will actually put clothes on now because I'm about to do some buying and selling.
Uh, so, hang on. Oh yeah, I need to go pick up the Daedric Longsword. There's some stuff that I dumped on Frost that I want to sell. Did I not leave the Daedric Longsword on Frost? Or did I sell it already? I sold it. I sold it in Dawnstar. Yeah, okay, I do remember that. I did I did sell it in Dawnstar. That's fine. Yeah. I've cleared this place out pretty much from hanging moss. I haven't incidentally gotten access to the Orc Strongholds yet, have I? No, because normally the way I do is by trading the Daedra Heart to this guy, but uh, obviously we're not doing that because we need the Daedra Heart for Valendron. Um, head to Bethella. See if she has any worthwhile potions for sale. But if I can get good with... Um, Alteration spells. Uh, with Paralyze specifically, we could be in really, really good shape. The hags. Ah, so you're an alchemist then. I need to keep an eye open for Fortify Alteration potions because those will come in very handy. Okay, so she's got Fortify potions of all the ones that we care about. That's pretty good. She doesn't actually have a lot of ingredients, that's surprising. I guess maybe I already bought stuff? Huh. Okay. Um, well, I think I want to buy each of these, right? Good, good, and good. Barely enough money, but fortunately I do have things to sell, so it's not like I'm leaving here with nothing. Um, although it looks like we have less to sell than I thought I did. I should have used one of those, whatever. We'll ditch the fair for now. Uh, pa, 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 pa. Oh, yeah, she can buy skooma. Nice. And the sleeping tree sap. Fun with a spider. Am I ever going to remember to use this? Probably not, right? Um, and then, yes. That was another big thing that I wanted to sell. I want to see what the glitter dust does that I can break this down into, see if it's any good. I'm not convinced it is, but it might be. Now you let me know if you need a cure. It's smelters, right? That you break um, gemstones down at. Oh, what did it say? Hang on, what? I wasn't reading. Do you need the basic smithing perk to make glitter dust as well? It's possible that you do. With the right smithing experience. Yes, okay. So I can't I make those the without the basic smithing perk, which I don't want. I do not, in fact, give a shit about that. Okay. So... Let's go do it. Let's go clear it. And I want to try paralysis out on the Briar Heart. It's possible that Briar Hearts are immune to paralysis just because. Why is my stamina not coming back? What? Why does my stamina not come back when I'm just running around? What? My stamina regen should be better than that. What the fuck? 
I don't know. Something weird's going on there. Okay, um... Well, my drama. Buff. B. Walker. Mute. And let's go. I wonder how good the absorb, like, health, stamina, magicka effects are as, like, offensive things. I wonder how well they would work. Absorb health in particular. Less, I don't care so much about stamina and magicka. But absorb health might be worth investing in. Just to see how well it actually works. Now, we do need blur for this because... The Forsworn are archers. There's a lot of archers. In fact, ah, uh, fuck. Yeah, I think we're going to need, um, I think we're going to need Elsewhere Fondue. Realistically. Just to be safe. And then we can head on in. Ancestor Guardian gets out of line. Uh, if, if the Broha gets out of line, we can use Ancestor Guardian. But I actually kind of want to try out Paralysis. Let's see how this works. Six seconds, it said. Well, I mean, if it does that to everyone, that's pretty fucking good, eh? Mr. Briarheart coming for me? I mean, he's going to alert everyone else. He always does. Oh, my God. My Magicka regen is good enough that in combat, I'm still regenerating Magicka even with Blur active. It's official. We fucking did it. We fucking did it, guys. Okay. Wow, that's a lot of people. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to use a bunch of magic potions. Good surprise nobody. This work on the bright heart. Oh my god, it does. Oh my god. Oh my god. As long as we can keep up the Magicka, we can just stunlock these motherfuckers. That is amazing. The fact that I use a two-handed weapon is sort of a problem here. Oh my god. Oh fuck, okay. He managed to get back up. And then these guys are archers, so... That is less of a problem. Because Blur! Okay, I think we found our strat, guys. I think we found our strat. Holy fuck. Damn, empty black soul gem. That's a hell of a thing to just find. I cannot believe that worked so well. Okay, when it says attempt to paralyze, I think what it means is pa paralyze. I think it just means paralyze. Uh, except the reason it says attempt is because it's possible for, for people to resist with like magic resistance and absorption, etc., etc. I think that's the reason why it's phrased that way. Um, I'm going to grab some gold because it sells for quite a bit. Nice. So, yeah, because not one of those spells failed. Every single one of those succeeded. And, to be fair, that is in line, power level-wise, with what I would expect for a spell of this level. Uh, it, it, just, it just lines up, you know. So as long as I can keep the magicka high, I can keep them stunlocked. And that's a hell of a thing. That is one hell of a thing. If that works on fucking giants, holy shit. We are in business. We are in business. Oh my god. Okay. Colskeg is clear. A fight that would otherwise a, a dungeon that would otherwise have been quite a threat. Trivialized by that spell. Now, of course, we need to bear in mind there are enemies who have, like, magic resistance, magic absorption, etc. In particular, enemy wizards have all that shit. Um, Tyrannus, if we ever try and fight Tyrannus, he has very high magic absorption, if I remember rightly. Like, he's really annoying. And Kano, for example. 
But against wizards, we don't really need the paralysis. We'll just use, like, magic resistance and tank. I think that's the main plan. Okay. Okay. This, uh... This character, finally... Finally, we've reached a point where I'm like, I can see how this character is going to succeed. Blah, 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 blah. No, I need to talk to Gat. Oh, Gat, don't go inside. I need to talk to you. Thank you. We'll head back to work right away. Take this. It's the least I can do. Okay, Gat. There we go. I mean, I don't think you need to actually hear him say that. Uh, in order to be welcome in the strongholds, but... It's always worth double checking, just making sure. Yes, I am indeed welcome in the strongholds. Thank fuck. Okay, brilliant. Also, there's a load of juniper around here that I think I have picked. Nice. Oh, it was just that one bush. Never mind. Okay. How much money have I got? 2.2k. That's solid. Can we go? Can we actually do this? Can we do Valendron? Was there something else I wanted to do before the before Valendron? Can't think of anything. I've got the troll fat, I've got the data heart. Fuck it. It's maybe a terrible idea. Maybe an awful idea. But might also be really, really good. So Lagerspur is Oh, near Riften. I always forget where Lagerspur is. Okay. Where do you want to go? So to Riften then. I don't think there's anything else I want to do first. Yep, this is all fine. Let's go. You might run into some of them lizard folk in Riften. Quite a few of them work the docks there. Not sure why. They like swimming in the lake, maybe. I should be able to quite easily help these guys beat the giant because I can just paralyze the fucking giant. The the downside of the paralysis strat is that I use a two-handed weapon, right? So paralyze. I then have to waste a bunch of the time on the paralysis, switching my weapon. Uh, so that I can actually do anything. Uh, okay, hang on, I need to make sure that I'm not crazy over-encumbered. Although Transmute now lasts for so long that it's not that big of a deal. Yeah, we'll dump the Greatsword on Frost. Because we don't really need it right now. Oops, oh, fuck's sake. You take all the bolts always. 18, yeah, 18 is fine. Uh... Everything else seems about right. Yeah, seems about right. Cool. Okay. Um, we're going to want all of our buff, obviously. Is it going to take us more than half an hour? Probably not, right? Do. Do. And we probably want the fondue. We definitely want the fondue. The question is whether I wait until after we get to Lagerspa to use it. I think we probably, I think I probably do. We want to absolutely get because we're really, really short on elsewhere fondue. Um, so Lagerspa, as far as I can tell, is like in this corner right here. Uh, where's that? Is that? Oh, hang on, what? I'm trying to see if I can match the angle. Is it that? Yeah, I think it's like here. That doesn't look very far away from Rifted at all. No, it's not. It's like down, it's, it's down here somewhere. Okay. Lagish bird is. Oh boy. This could be interesting. This isn't a slaughterfish lake, is it? What's up, Blackbriar? Hang on. I need to go around. Got the like the normal way. Yeah, like this. There we go. Holy fuck. If this paralysis works can like every single time on giants. I did not realise paralysis was so fucking strong. Because the way it's worded makes it seem like there's a chance of failure, right? But it it doesn't seem like there is, or at least if there is, it, it, it maybe it like varies depending on the level of the target or something. I don't know. None of those motherfuckers got paralyzed. Uh, like none of those motherfuckers resisted it. Every single one was paralyzed. 
That bodes well. I'm going to be honest. That bodes really, really well. This is going to be fucking hilarious. If I do this, if I... Am I going to stunlock a giant to death? Is that what's going to happen? But the, the fucking stunlock monsters that are giants in Skyrim are going to be like... I'm going to stun lock the fuck out of you, and I'm like, no. Uno reverse. Get fucked, bitch. That, I mean, that just feels poetic. Also, give me more flowers. I love the idea of stun locking giants in this game. That, that just sounds absolutely fantastic. Okay. Um, here we are. Here's Luggish Burr. That's a bear. That is an actual. That is a full-on bear. Get out the warhammer and fuck him up. Knock him down. Nice. Finish him off, please. Hitbox. There we go. Thank you. I don't think the giant has spawned yet. I'm gonna leave Frost here, so I can approach on foot, because that will allow me to um. Blast paralysis as soon as I see the giant. Oh, uh, why is that goat an enemy? There's no, there's no fucking spriggans here, are there? What is going on? That's not normal. What am I seeing here? What are these red dots? There's the giant. Okay. Okay, that didn't work. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! We're in trouble! 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 They're all dead? You're kidding me! They're all dead, and the giants? You're fucking joking! They're all dead, and the giant is still up. Oh my god! Okay, we're in trouble! We're in trouble! We're in trouble! Jesus Christ! And the paralysis doesn't work. Okay. So you know how I was like, we're going to Uno reverse the giant, and then the giant just fucking Uno reversed the shit out of me? Okay, how how do we... How do we paralyze this thing? Because that paralysis spell just didn't work. Like, straight up didn't work. Um, I was expecting there to be an army of orcs fighting it. But th there's none. They're all gone. Okay. Um... Running away, running back this way. Motherfucker. Well, good thing there's terrain, otherwise I'd have been in serious trouble. Where's the giant? There he is. It, it's just not working, right? It just seems to be immune. Have they made giants immune to paralysis in Requiem? Because that fucks up my entire plan. Yep, looks like they have. Right. Wonderful. Wonderful. Okay, well, there goes my plan. We can't do this quest. That's wildly disappointing. Giants do not need to be buffed to that degree. You kill them with a crossbow, of course, but, like, fuck me. That is disappointing. That is very, very disappointing. These goats existing as red dots on my radar, tanking my magicka regen. I mean, we can still attempt the quest. It's just going to be so much more dangerous, and we're going to want to be relying on, like, summons and everything, I think. Um, yeah, they're all just dead already. Fantastic. Where is the person that I'm supposed to speak to? Halt. You have no business here, outsider. 
Oh, hello. Uh, can I talk to you? How do I talk to you? Because you're the one who's supposed to give me the quest. We should not be here, outsider. Okay. Hang on. How do I start this quest? Speak to Atop. Was Atop the one who got launched into the stratosphere? Yeah, there we go. Forgive Fucking hell. There we go. Words. Please, our chief. Your Mars refuses help. Your Mars. Has I must. Be but I cannot travel the Malcast Shrine. I beg of you. Can you bring me troll fat and a Daedra heart? Okay, cool. No this quest has started. Right. Um. Please, we are counting on you. Interesting. Okay. Mark, let me just do a quick bit of Googling, because... I mean, the paralysis just wasn't working, right? Like, it was literally doing nothing. Requiem Paralyze Giant. Hmm. Literally, a bunch of these, a bunch of these are talking about how you can paralyze giants, like using poisons. Which, Yeah, according to this, you can paralyze giants. And this is like a relatively recent thing. But it looks like maybe you can only do it with poisons? That's surprising. I mean, I have the ingredients for a bunch of paralysis poisons. So I can make a bunch of paralysis poisons. Let's see if that works. And I can shoot them with the crossbow. Plus, each poison is multiple use. Maybe it's possible, but lower chance. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I'm, I'll, I'll try the paralysis poison. Because I have the ingredients for a bunch. I've got one briar heart. I didn't use any of that Gleam Blossom, right? Yeah, so I've got Gleam Blossom. I've got one Briar Heart. How many Venomous Spittle did I have? I've got, like, two, right? So I can make three? Yeah, so I can make three Paralysis Poisons. And, because I have the perk, each poison lasts for, like, five shots. So that's a lot of Paralysis. Yeah, okay. I think we might be all right here. I think we might be able to do this. We just have to use poisons instead of um, spells. So, Briar Heart. Uh, Daedra Heart. Nope, not Spade Tail. Daedra Heart. Gleam Blossom. Grab three. Venomous Spittle. Do I have anything that also... That I can use to do... Um, Anything that I can I can use to do uh damage and ooh interesting anything that I can use to do damage health and lingering damage health so that way I could make paralysis and damage and decay poison that would be very very good nope nope um because lingering damage health is usually stronger. It's just that obviously it takes more time. Damage health, lingering damage health. No, nothing. Ooh, actually, I want to check Giant's Toe plus Bear. Um, bear Heart, because that could actually be very strong.
forget that heart. Oh. Yeah. Okay, yeah, nothing super useful. In which case, let's just take like a random death bell, a couple of death bells so we can put damage health. And actually, let's check whether lingering damage health is better. With Slaughterfish Egg have that? It does, yeah. Whoops. Oh, that's two of them. Um, okay, let's do some potion making. We need nothing from outside. Your Mars will provide for us. Um, cannot carry on this road. Where is an alchemical... There should be an alchemical shed somewhere. There we go. They always have alchemy labs here. Um, okay, so... Bear heart, giant toe. That's not great. Wow. I thought it would improve the magnitude, but I guess it just it just doesn't. That is disappointing. Guess bear heart's just better. Never mind. Um so then what else did we need to make? Nern root is just damage health. Clean blossom. Venomous spittle. Nern root. And it gives them magic resistance. Fucking hilarious. Um, okay, so what do we do? Do like death bell? Twenty-four points. Not the best. What about slaughterfish egg? Eight points per second for sixty seconds. That's how much total. Eighty per ten. That's a lot of health. That's a lot of health. Uh, might as well, right? Yeah. No reason not to, and then a briar heart paralysis poison. Yeah, eight seconds. Cool. That's fine. There's nothing else I want on this. Nope. I guess I guess I could make a fear potion, but I don't think it makes a difference. Cool. And then, yeah, that's everything. Um, I guess I leave the rest on frost. Let's go do that now. I've already got it, my friend, but uh, you need to bear with me. Uh, okay, so Bear Heart, Blue Mountain Flower, Daedra Heart. Also, I just realized I did forget to pick up the Troll Fat, so I do need that as well. Troll Fat, there we go. Cool. So, we have three Poisons of Paralysis, which, according to the internet... Good work on giants. Excellent. Now, you must come with me. You become a part of this. You must be present for the ritual. Okay. How do I kill a giant without if the if this poison turns out not to work either? Uh I guess with Atronarchs, that's pretty much it, right? Because Ancestor Guardian does not help against Dunlock. You're taking your fucking time about doing this ritual. Why are you going inside? Is the ritual meant to be inside? Oh. I thought it was... I was pretty sure it was here. Do I need to go in? It is time, Mars. Oh, yeah, yeah. You bring an outsider here. And now insist I call on Malakath for help. Oh, he has clearly forsaken me. Oh, it's theft. You try my is there anything worth stealing, though? I mean, that's literally what I've already got, so no. Doing nothing will not grant our tribe relief from this curse. We must try. She's right. Uh, fine. Let's get this over with. Come on, Garak. Gar Garak, your ma your Mars? Mars. Who's Garuk? Is it this guy? Garak. There we go. Cool name. Can we hurry up, please? This is taking longer than I expected. My buffs are wearing off. Go. Out the door. Out the door. Are we leaving or what, Atub? There we go. Fucking off. Oh yeah, and every poison has multiple shots, so 
that's going to be a big deal. Now we begin also, eight seconds, long time. Great Malakath, we beseech you, aid us in our time of need. Why are we bothering with this? You pathetic ah, get weakling! Fun. What's that? Malakath has heard my pleas. He speaks to us. Oh, yeah. You dare summon me, Yamars? You don't deserve to call yourself an orc. Yeah, get fucked, you mouse. You're weak, you're small, and you're an embarrassment. You let giants, giants, overrun my shrine. Bring me their leader's club as an offering, and I might release you from this curse. So it will be. Book Jamaz. Woohoo! Very well. You, outsider, come here. I Me? want a word. This I didn't is do anything though. <laughs> yeah. I'm stuck. You're going with. Don't worry. I'll make it worth your while. Thanks to you, I've just been. I didn't say I wouldn't fight. Meet me sure, outside Hollowstone Cave. You clear the way to the giant for me, and I'll make sure you get paid for it. Um. Yeah, no, he doesn't. I think he tries to kill you, doesn't he? If, he? if he survives the fight with the giant, which he shouldn't do because the giant fucking murders him. However, oh, I'm not sure how well this is going to go. I don't know if this poison is going to work. The fact that the paralysis didn't work was super scary. We've got Ancestor Guardian, but that's only a temporary measure. Oh, this could be interesting. Either way. I think I have completely lost track of, of what my timings are at the moment, but I think it's been about now. So I'm going to pop off and I'm going to make myself another cappuccino. And when I get back, we're going to see if we can find some giants. Get back in a tip. Don't go anywhere.